Welcome back to another episode of Bitcoin Dorks, your daily dose of cryptocurrency news and updates. Today, we're going to talk about Binance, one of the largest cryptocurrency exchanges in the world and how it has recently become the center of attention in the crypto community. Binance has been making headlines recently due to rumors and allegations surrounding the exchange's regulatory compliance and transparency. In this video, we're going to dive deep into the issue and provide you with all the latest updates. Binance was founded in 2017 by Changpeng Zhao, a Chinese-Canadian programmer and entrepreneur. Since then, the exchange has grown to become one of the most popular and successful cryptocurrency exchanges in the world. However, Binance has faced numerous regulatory and legal issues over the years. In 2018, the exchange was forced to relocate from China to Malta due to regulatory pressure. More recently, several countries, including the UK, Japan, and Canada have issued warnings or taken action against Binance for operating without proper licenses or registration. The most recent controversy surrounding Binance began with a tweet from a pseudonymous Twitter account called FintechZoom. The tweet claimed that the exchange was under investigation by the IRS and the Department of Justice, DOJ, for money laundering and tax evasion. The tweet quickly went viral, and several media outlets picked up the story. However, Binance denied the allegations stating that they had not been contacted by the IRS or DOJ and that the tweet was FUD, or fear, uncertainty, and doubt. Despite Binance's denial, the rumor continued to spread and many in the crypto community began to question the exchange's transparency and regulatory compliance. The statement also addressed the recent regulatory actions taken against Binance in various countries stating that the exchange was actively working with regulators to ensure our compliance with all applicable laws. Binance also announced that it was hiring former U.S. Senator Max Baucus as a policy and government relations advisor further emphasizing its commitment to regulatory compliance and transparency. While Binance has denied the allegations and emphasized its commitment to compliance the issue serves as a reminder of the importance of due diligence and careful research when it comes to choosing a cryptocurrency exchange. The story broke on March 11, 2021, when Forbes published an article titled How Binance Created the World's Biggest Cryptocurrency Exchange. The article went into detail about Binance's rise to prominence and the role played by founder Changpeng Zhao, or CZ, as he is commonly known. Binance had created a corporate structure designed to deceive regulators and conceal its operations. According to Forbes, Binance had set up a complex web of companies with no clear ownership or jurisdiction making it difficult for regulators to determine who was responsible for what. The article also alleged that Binance had failed to comply with anti-money laundering, AML and Know Your Customer, KYC regulations and that it had moved its operations from China to Malta in an effort to escape regulatory scrutiny. The article caused a stir in the crypto community with some defending Binance and others calling for an investigation into the exchange's practices. Binance itself issued a statement denying the allegations and CZ took to Twitter to defend the exchange and criticize the article. But the controversy did not end there. On March 12, 2021, the Financial Times published an article alleging that Binance was under investigation by the Commodity Futures Trading Commission, CFTC, in the United States for allowing U.S. citizens to trade on its platform in violation of U.S. regulations. The fact that Binance, the largest cryptocurrency exchange in the world is now under scrutiny for its practices is a sign that regulators are taking a more aggressive stance towards the industry. As cryptocurrencies continue to gain mainstream acceptance it is likely that we will see more regulatory action in the months and years to come. It remains to be seen how the controversy surrounding Binance will play out, but one thing is clear the cryptocurrency industry is facing increasing scrutiny from regulators and exchanges will need to work harder than ever to comply with regulations and maintain the trust of their users. However, there are still questions about the legitimacy of this supposed leak as there have been cases of fake leaks in the past. Binance CEO Changpeng Zhao also tweeted that the exchange has not suffered any data breaches and that the supposed leak is a FUD, or fear, uncertainty, and doubt tactic employed by some to spread false information and cause panic. Despite the controversy surrounding this supposed leak it has caused a significant stir in the crypto community with many speculating about the potential implications for Binance and its users. Some are questioning the security measures in place at Binance while others are concerned about the possibility of their personal information being compromised. In response to the speculation and concerns Binance has reiterated its commitment to security and has advised its users to enable two-factor authentication and to use unique passwords for their accounts. The exchange has also stated that it has a dedicated team of security experts who are continuously monitoring and improving its security systems. It remains to be seen whether this supposed leak will have any long-term impact on Binance and the crypto industry as a whole. 
while the incident has certainly caused some turmoil in the short term it is possible that it will ultimately serve as a reminder of the importance of strong security measures in the world of crypto. In conclusion, the recent controversy surrounding Binance has once again highlighted the challenges facing the cryptocurrency industry when it comes to regulatory compliance and transparency. As always, we'll continue to monitor the situation and provide you with the latest updates. That's all for today's episode of Bitcoin Dorks. Make sure to subscribe to our channel for more cryptocurrency news and updates.